There is always change in the air if you can keep your focus on the antics of Chris Funk. I am so excited to show you this right now, but in order for this to work, I need someone to help me out. Would, would you be willing to help me out, miss? Yeah, give it a round of applause. Come on, uh, come on. Uh, what is your name? Hi, Kenya. Uh, Kenya, I've got a couple things I want to show you really quickly. First and foremost, a blindfold. You're going to blindfold me in a moment. Very important that uh, I don't see what's going on. I also have your five cans of spray paint and a mannequin. We're going to be doing a little bit of arts and crafts. Oh, we also have the envelope of wonder. Check it out right here. Envelope of wonder. Kenya, what I need you to do, though, is come over here and blindfold me. Can you do that? There we go. Oh, make sure it's a bow, not a double knot. As soon as you're done, you go back over to your place there and just let me know that you're ready. Can you do that for me, Kenya? Excellent. Let me know as soon as you're ready, Kenya. Awesome, Kenya, what I want you to do is grab any one of those five cans of spray paint. Let me know when you have one. Shake it up, and then you're gonna quickly just spray paint the top so we know that the top is that color. As soon as you've thrown that spray paint can in the garbage, what I want you to do is go ahead and pull another can of spray paint. Let me know as soon as you have that can. So I want you to color the, the skirt. Can you quickly just spray paint the skirt so we know the skirt is that color? And once it's in the garbage, I want you to go ahead and take another can of spray paint, shake it up. Let me know when you have one. That one. Excellent. Color the belt. Really quickly, just spray paint the belt. <laughs> Let me know when you have another one, can you? Excellent. What I want you to do is spray paint the glasses on the mannequin. Can you do that for me, please? And then there's one last can of spray paint as soon as you're done with that one. And just spray the hat, if you could. Just make sure that that hat is good and colorful like the rest. Whoa, all right, all right. Let's have a little look. Ooh, that is awesome. All right. Kind of went all Andy Warhol on the face there. This is wonderful. We have a woman that has a pink hat, yellow glasses, green top, orange belt, purple skirt. Out of five different cans of spray paint, you could have had 120 different possibilities. That's what you made. Earlier today, I was a little bit bored, did a little drawing, a little coloring. Brought it with me, you wanna see it? Of course you do, check this out. Inside the envelope of wonder, I happen to have a drawing that matches Kenya's 100%. Boom, there it is. We got a woman that has orange hat, yellow glasses, green top, orange belt, purple skirt. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You see that? That's kind of like a sympathy applause right there. That's what she gave me. I get it. This is what we call in the magic business a throwaway gag. Ha, ha, ha. You had a bunch of drawings. You picked out the one that matches. Well, that's stupid. <laughs> this, however, is a moment of impossibilities. That's what we call in the magic biz, because every single one that I did was a woman that had a pink hat, yellow glasses, green top, orange belt, purple skirt. That's right. Each and every one did a whole bunch of them to show you that they were all pink hat, yellow glasses, green top, orange belt, purple skirt, just to show you how impossible it was. In fact, I made it a wee bit larger. Check this out. We can you come over here, Kenya? Just hold on to this end and just pull it nice and wide and open. Hold it up nice and high. We have here a woman that has a go purple skirt, orange belt, pink hat, yellow glasses. Couldn't have done it without Kenya. She was fantastic. Give it up for Kenya, everybody.